What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to RC Car Garage. And in today's video, I got some RC news for you. So RC four wheel drive has come up with another scale accessory for your rig and they did not disappoint on this one. They have come out with a single speed transmission fully licensed by TCI. If you guys can see this picture here, the bell housing, the middle section, the rear section of this transmission, this thing looks absolutely awesome guys. Um, this transmission is fully licensed by TCI Automotive and it is fully billet aluminum, CNC machined. Um, it weighs in at 5.86 ounces. It has a gear ratio of 10.1 to 1. Um, I'll leave this up here for you guys to see uh, the width, the length, the height and everything. The output shaft length is 0.33 inches. Um, this thing just looks absolutely awesome. As you guys can see, you have your ball bearing here in the middle. You got your output shaft sticking out through the back of the transmission. And uh, you have your screws. Looks like it has like a gasket that comes with it, which is a nice touch, by the way. And here you see it in this picture with the V8 engine that they have on their site right now. Pick that engine up with this transmission. Make your rig look 100% awesome. Um, here in this picture, you can see it on the uh, Trailfinder 2 chassis. And I'll tell you what, it, it looks awesome. They just now have to come out with a front radiator. And if you guys can see where my pointer is, my mouse pointer, it looks like they uh, should be coming out. They probably will come out with some headers or something just to make it give that more of a scale look uh, that it definitely definitely needs. So you can pick up this uh, transmission on their website right now for $83.99 on RC four wheel drives website. Uh, and don't forget to pick up the engine, make everything just look right, transmission and the engine, and you'll be set, ready to go. So in more news that we got for you, Intigy has come out with a full alloy conversion hop-up kit for the Traxxas 110 slash 4x4. You can use this kit for, you can use this kit with the lower center of gravity or the normal height slash 4x4. Uh, this kit features alloy front and rear lower arms, alloy front and rear shock towers, front caster blocks and knuckles, uh, rear hub carriers, steering rack, front and rear silver universal telescoping drive shafts. Um, it is available in two colors. The blue is one of them. The other one is probably a silver is my guess. I don't know, but that's my guess is probably in a silver color. Um, I kind of like the blue. The blue actually does look really nice on there. Um, you can pick this up on their website right now for $129.99. Um, Soar RC products has come out with EPX trailing arms for GKS suspension. Um, these trailing arms are made out of 6061 CNC machine billet aluminum, uh, fully rebuildable pillet, Pivot ball cartridge, no rod ends to worry about breaking. Uh, recessed nut captures to minimize shock hardware sticking out, which is a nice feature. You get the uh, screw coming out and the nut right here, right where my pointer is. And instead of it sticking out here and end up looking ugly, really, they recessed it here so that the nut is sticking on the, staying on the inside there and basically just has everything look really nice. Um, these things actually look really, really nice. Uh, you can go on to Soar RC Products Facebook page and you can get more information about that. So we got some news from Cross RC. They have upgrades for the SCX24 guys. 
now available on their website. We're actually going to check out some of their products that they have for the SCX24. Um, you have the steering cup here weighing in at 8 grams. You have a chassis frame conversion for the SCX24. You have brass wheel hex, uh, brass counterweights. You have um, <laughs> widened axles, more brass wheel hexes, more counterweights. Uh, they have aluminum alloy front and rear housings. Um, more housing right there. Transmission covers. More axle housings. Uh, suspensions. Shocks. Everything that you guys want. They pretty much have upgrades for the SEX24. Aluminum steering servo. Brass counterweight for the... Uh, for the transmission, for the axle, um, there's more counterweights there. And this is what I was actually looking for, the Starfish B-Lock four-piece, I mean, not four-piece, <laughs> the aluminum Starfish B-Lock wheels that they have. I'll admit, they actually look pretty good. Diameter 28 millimeter, height 14.5. Uh, I'm actually looking to see if there is any information about weight on these things, but it does not say. So you can pick those up on uh, Cross RC's website for $29.99. Uh, stainless steel chassis army, armor guard and a screw box that you can get off of their website. Go on to uh, Cross RC's website and you can pick up anything you guys want right now on their website for the SEX24. Now, last week, I believe it was, uh, Tamiya, yes, last week, Tamiya released information about the new chassis that they're coming out with, the TD4. And this week, they're not playing around. This week, they have released some hop-up parts. They will be releasing some hop-up parts for the new TD4 chassis. As you guys see here, they had, they're going to have the uh, TD4 assembly universal shafts, differential nut and screw set, aluminum servo stays, slipper clutch set. Uh, right down here, they're going to have, so have titanium screw set, uh, C parts, the uprights and deep parts of suspension arms. So they're already coming out with upgrades for the TD4 chassis that we see right here. So, oh, I can't, oh, I can somewhat. So this chassis, you guys can see that the uh, shocks, the front shocks are laying flat which is nice. They had this uh, rod going through right here. I'm guessing that rod is for the four wheel drive. The ESC is right here in the back. The motor, the driver is sitting over top of the uh, battery. I mean, not the motor. Uh, I believe the motor is right here on the side. And this tub looks pretty damn good, really. <laughs> Realistically, it looks pretty damn good. So here in this picture, you see, let me minimize that. You see that they got the all three Avantes that are there, uh, which is pretty cool. Uh, I kind of want to get my hands on this, uh, this Super Avanti and uh, check it out. Oh, right here, I'm at, I haven't seen, didn't see it. I just saw it right now, but right here we got the servo with the... Uh, rod coming right across there right in front of the driver now uh, this thing it looks 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 pretty cool <laughs> i am uh, very happy to say uh so that's pretty much all i got for you guys this week on rc news uh hope you guys enjoy the video and i will keep you guys updated with any more information that i see here about any rcs um and if you guys want just you know hit me up in the comment section and let me know any more type of info.
that you guys want to know. <laughs> so, guys and girls, thank you for watching. Hit that like button, subscribe, and I will see you guys in another video. You guys have a good night.